going on guys? I want to start off by apologizing that I have been inactive for so long. Um, it's pretty much because of work. Um, I had to go on a business trip. I was on Kentucky and a whole bunch of other things that was kind of taking me away from being home and giving you guys updated videos. So I just wanted to take today to give you a video and kind of update you on what's going on with the hatch right now. Pretty much right now, uh, I haven't really done much with the car. It's kind of been sitting here for the past week, week and a half. But yesterday, I bought a GSR rear disc assembly uh, with energy bushings. So that's going to be a good deal. Um, it's pretty much going to get rid of me having to replace my rear wheel bearing. So I have to slap on this whole new assembly and we'll be good. Just slap some rotors on it. It didn't come with rotors or anything. I'll show you, I'll show you a video right now. Here they are. There's just a whole bunch of trash over here that I need to throw away. But um, it came with energy bushings. These are energy bushings. I'm getting the light a little bit so you can see. Energy bushings. Um, but this is pretty much the whole GSR assembly. I picked it up for a hundred bucks. Not a bad deal. And I just need to get rotors and brake pads and I'll pretty much be ready to put it on. So that's what I plan on doing. Um, also, my birthday is coming up in three days. So hopefully I could possibly get some car parts. Maybe, I don't know. I usually fucking get socks and underwear, so I doubt it. But um, that's pretty much it for today. I don't think I'm gonna be taking it out anytime soon. It hasn't really been, well, I wouldn't say running right, but I just don't feel right driving this car right now because of, mainly because of the oil leaking out of the oil pan. And I need a new oil pan and I need to retap it. So I'm just gonna get a whole new oil pan. I'm gonna do a whole new tap, maybe run a different kind of return line because I kind of want to make it shorter, but uh, I'm not, I haven't really been moving this thing. But other than that, that's pretty much what I plan on doing. We do to you to answer some questions. <laughs> we gotta answer questions for YouTube. Huh? I gotta answer questions for YouTube. I told him i give him a Q&A. I told it's me and you. I don't know about cars. <laughs> One of the questions I got asked was, um, pretty much, I was at the one six motorsports store and um, I was looking for a car. I had cash in hand and I didn't know what car I wanted to get, whether it was an EG or a EK or I kind of wanted, I wanted an Integra actually. I wanted a DC2 Integra, but um, Guillermo hit me up while me and Steven were sitting at a gas station because I was contemplating on what car I should get because we were just sitting, we were dead sitting at the gas station for a good 10 minutes trying to think of what car I could get. And I was trying to get a car that day. So Guillermo happened to text me and send me a picture like, yo, look at this car, look at this hatch over here. It was like $2,700. And it was out in Milwaukee. And you were mad at me that night because I drove all the way out to Milwaukee. And I was supposed to see you but you were mad because I drove all the way out to Milwaukee. You don't remember. I grabbed Guillermo and all three of us drove out to Milwaukee that night to go check out that car. Um, at the time, I didn't really see the picture he sent me. I thought it was an EG at first, but when we got out there, I realized it was an EK and I actually wanted an EK as bad as I wanted an Integra, so. It had all the paperwork, it had a full build or a full build sheet and it had a JDM B eighteen B, so I was kinda interested in it. So just pretty much ended up picking up the car. It was around Halloween last year, 2016, so that's how I got my hatch pretty much. Um there was one more question. Oh, what's my day job? Someone asked me what's my day job. Um my day job is I'm uh audio programmer, AV technician at a small business firm out here. Um, I mainly do like big businesses like Advocate Health Center and um, True Value and pretty much corporations that have big boardrooms and I 
program their audio and their microphones for their communication to their other corporate offices. So that's my day job. It's pretty fucking boring, but it pays for my car and her. Um, there's another question. I think someone messaged me. I think it was about Adam. Adam's not here right now and I haven't seen him in a week. So, but, um, I seen a couple of comments of what you want me to do to my car and what you guys want to see done to it. One that really stuck out to me is my passenger side um, win uh, window. Um, so I guess someone noticed that it was fucking broken. And yeah, it is really broken and I do want to get it fixed. I just don't know where it's broken at. I don't know how it's broken. The uh, actual thing that connects to the door handle moves around a lot. So I don't know how I'm going to fix it. I think I have to take my door panel apart and I kind of don't feel like it. But yeah, it's kind of annoying not being able to roll up the window. Well, you can roll up the window, but not really fast. And it's kind of annoying. But yeah, that's something I need to get fixed. I think that's really it. There wasn't really that much questions being asked other than that. Unless I'm forgetting something. So I went back and looked at the comments on the YouTube video and there was only one question I forgot that was asked is what clutch is in my car? Uh, I actually have a stage one flywheel and a stage one Exedi uh, clutch. So that's what's in the car trans wise. You guys wanted to see pools. I do need to do more pools. My brakes are fucking terrible, so. That's things I need to get fixed along with my inner and outer tie rods. I think it's only on the left side that is fucked up. The right side seems pretty stiff. But other than that, once I get those little minor things fixed, I'm going to be definitely trying to rip on it. So I think that's it for the Q&A. You got anything? My food. Huh? I need my food. It was a pretty short video, but answer your questions and... I don't know what I'm going to be working on the car next. Um, I bought some a rear disc assembly for the from a GSR for the hatch. So whenever I get a chance to buy some rotors and some brake pads all the way around, that's when that will be going in. But other than that, I don't know when I'll really be working on my car. I haven't drove it in a week and a half, which is kind of depressing. But mm -hmm. see ya.